Hello, my name is Jess Springer. I'm an application specialist with the PPI group. In this exercise, I will quickly describe the inventor workflow for Pack and Go. This tool lets you package the currently active file and its reference files into a single location. Once assembled into a single location, the files can then be distributed to your collaborators. The preliminary action you want to take uh, are, is to go through and resolve all the file links and, and make sure that they open correctly. If you have anything pop-ups like this, for example, um, take the time to track down the missing parts, assemblies, and sub-assemblies. Once you've resolved all those link issues, you can go ahead and get started on pack and go. The first thing you want to do the step in step one or in this first procedure, procedural thing is to click on the inventor icon and go to save as pack and go. So this window is going to pop up and from here you can browse to a location to save the file into. I have picked my desktop here, but you can, you'll see if I pull the trigger on there I can kind of hunt down someplace. To go. Maybe I'll make a new file folder called uh, Okay, so after I've done that I'm going to search for the files in the directory. That's pathed back to my to the location in my structure that will uh, that houses all that stuff. You can see all the parts and pieces that are ready to go. Then I can um, go ahead and pull the trigger on start and it will begin the process. Okay, as you can see, that was all pretty painless up here where all the folder or the files and folders, sub, sub assembly parts and pieces that I was working with. And uh, they've gone to that folder on the desktop that I placed it. I'll show you if I go down a couple of spaces you can see that I have all of the files that I've been uh, trying to upload or trying to pack up here okay so now that that's all complete I can just go ahead and say done and like I said you'll notice that all of the IPTs and assemblies sub-assemblies and uh, whatever drawing file type you're using, they're all they're already in that file and they're uh, ready to be zipped and sent to someone for upload or to a server for others to download, okay? Um, that pretty much wraps up how the steps for, the very simple steps for pack and go. Uh, thank you for listening and I appreciate your time. Ideally, this video was, easy, was an easy to use diagram of the process and here in this slide, are the steps we use to perform the tasks for pack and go. This closes our session. Again, thank you. I hope this is a helpful guide. Be sure to contact the PPI group if you need additional support.